Hello everyone, so on today's video, I'm going to show you how to use uh, or run and set up Sega CD for um, Batacera, and Sega CD was basically, it was a Sega Genesis with a CD player on it, so it was essentially a 16-bit uh, video game console with, which could play CD media. So the types of files the Sega CD can run on Batacera is .cue, .iso, .iso, .chd, and .m3u. And m3u is a it enables you to um, run multiple CDs. So these are the files that you need to run it. And the BIOS pack that I found most useful was this one right here. I'll leave this in the video descriptions below so you can uh, access it and get the files that you need to get uh, Sega CD to run. So I downloaded it here. It says I need three, I need um, these three BIOS files. And let's see if they're in there. They are they are in there. I'm gonna go here and get them out, extract them out. Okay, just like that. And now I want to go into my Batacera. The host name should be Batacera. It's not cap sensitive or anything. Go to share. BIOS here, put the files in there. And that's it. I already have them in there. But if you don't, they would just go in there. And the games go into ROMs. I think it's called Sega CD. There it is. Don't have anything in there, so I will have to put something in there. So I'll put these four games in there. Okay, great. So all of these games just have one CD, but if you want to create a m m 3 u file, let me go back and see if that's what the name is. It's dot m 3 u You could create it very simply just like this. Just go in here, open up Notepad, type in Notepad, open it up like so. And um, F2, Control C, Control V, dot CUE. This is a dot CUE file. These are the type of files that are executable right here. Dot CUE, as you can see. Um, and that's it. And I would just go here, save it, go into. Game was that Samurai Showdown. Go to all files. I'm gonna call it Sam Show dot M three U. Let me see if that's M three U, just to be sure. Okay, M three U. Okay, save it. Get out of here. This is a .m3u file that I created. I could run the game with this, or I could run the game with this. The only difference is when I run it with this, I could run multiple CDs with it. That's the only difference. But both files should run. This file .cue and this file .m3u.
But if you want to change the M3U file, you can by opening up Notepad. Go to Open, Control C, Control V. I would go to All Files, go here and edit it. If there was another file, then I would call it So on and so forth. If it had three discs, then it, it looked like this. But it only has one. So you get the idea, right? So now I'm going to go to my Batacera unit and I'm going to run some Sega CD games and show you how to use the emulator on Batacera. Okay, now I'm back on Batacera. I'm going to run a Sega CD or Mega CD. Same thing. They called it Mega Drive in Japan and in the United States they called it Sega. So this thing should work. You could press select and change some things if you want. You could change the emulator. I like Pico Drive. I'll just leave it at default because I don't have graphics card in, in this computer. Everything else is good. So let me start it. Should run. I have all the BIOS files in there, so it shouldn't be a problem. Sega CD was um, an add-on for the Sega Genesis or the Sega Mega Drive. It just enabled you to use a CD-ROM on it, so of course CD-ROMs could hold more memory than a cartridge. So, like, you can add full motion video like this, like in this game. multimedia craze back in the 1990s. You could play with either the D-pad or the analog, left analog stick. It runs perfectly good. No crashes or anything like that. If you want to 
go into the settings, you could press hot button and B and go in there like that. Change stuff. If you have to change the disk, you can change it here. I'm ejecting it and loading a new one. If you have a dot m3u file, then you can do that. You can change the region here. I think that's for the BIOS. I just left it on auto. I did. It automatically selects which one it needs, so you don't have to think about that too much. Six button pad. Okay, you could change that if you want. So I'm going to go back. Actually, I'm going to exit this game. I'm going to run that on there. Let's play this one. This was a 1980s um, laser disc game. This was released for the okay, Sega CD. What are you supposed to do? I hate these laser disc games. You have to just make quick reactions or something. Let's try this one. Samurai Showdown. Looks exactly like the Neo Geo version. A little bit worse.
Okay. Let me get out of here. That's all I want to show you. So, um, if you have any thoughts or questions, you could leave in the comment section below. And thanks for watching.